What's up, guys? And welcome back to MLB 21 Road to the Show. Your boy has been digging. I hired a PI to get some dirt on the guys up above us, and I'm reporting back with some pretty good news. So, uh, obviously, a few episodes ago, Skip asked us to change positions. It was something our team needed. We obliged. It's been kind of fun playing outfield, and it was a good move for us. So obviously, I mean, you know, playing third base for the Phillies is Alec Bohm. He's not going anywhere. He's 25 years old. He's super young. He's an 82 overall, has his whole career ahead of him. He's rock solid. We were not going to move up and take his spot at third. However, the left fielder for the Phillies just happens to be Andrew McCutcheon, and he's not doing so hot. He's cold right now. He's 35 years old, so he's kind of towards the ceiling of his career. He's a 77 overall, which is much more reachable. I think we're a 69 right now. And check out his stats. 88 at-bats, 8 runs, 2 home runs, a 182 average? Trash. Try 99 at-bats, 6 home runs. 22 RBIs and a 364 average. Now, the average could be a little bit better. I have simmed a few games. Yes, I know. I'm sorry. I'm not going to at all anymore because we really need to start focusing up and, 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 you know, playing out and playing our hearts out. We need to focus on building our overall up, though. That's our weak spot currently. We're only at a 69. I'm sure you guys know the best way to increase that is going to be through our, you know, missions and, and our, our little progression chart here. So we're doing a good job so far. Really, our, our main focus has to be, I mean, just playing well, having a high batting average and stuff, but our main focus has to be on getting extra base hits. That is that is where we're going to get the, the most out of anything. Plate appearances, so just straight up playing, and then also extra base hits. I mean, you got to keep in mind, you know, we, we also have the added benefit of the pitching side of things, which is, is kind of a little cherry on top. I'm not going to think that that's like a big part of what we have to offer. Yes, being a two-way player is cool. Hitting is obviously our focus, so we really need to work on our hitting. We need to focus on getting those extra base hits, focus on hitting those dingers, and our phone's going to ring her, baby. So uh, here we go. Let's let's see what we can do. We, we've got kind of our eyes on the prize. We've got a target here. He's got a target painted on his back, that's for sure, and it, it, it seems attainable fairly soon. We at least know what we need to do, and it, it, I'll be interested to see how it works out. You know, obviously... We could get called out well before we reach a 77 overall, but that's that's at least our main target that we need to keep in mind and, and kind of focus on for now. So. Just hit doubles and better all the way up till we get to that point, and uh, it's, I guess, simple in a sense. Here we go. Top of the second four-seam changeup curveball and a two-seam. We got our eyes on the prize, baby. Let's make it happen. First pitch double right here. First offering. First pitch double. Nope. It's going to be an out to center. Dang it. That could have been cool. Well hit ball there. Good read. Just couldn't find a gap. It's all right. Time to play a little bit more defense here. It's going to be catching a, another ball. I mean, you, you got to keep in mind every single play counts. Like this right here, it's going to add to my fielding. That's, that helps get to my overall. It's, you know, not necessarily... The biggest improvement, so but it helps. So, just got to do everything we can as best we can and focus on the hitting here. Got a couple of guys on. Ooh. Going to be throwing it home here. Pretty good throw. Pretty accurate. We'll take it. Shoot, we got bases loaded with no out to start this ball game off. That is not what we want. Looks like we were able to get out of it fairly unscathed, but we are down by one run here. Top of the fourth, nobody on. Four-seam change-up curve at a two-seam. Let's go, Trev. First pitch coming. Here it is. Oh, my goodness. That was way up out of the zone, but we'll take it. No, we won't. Find some space out there for the catch to retire the side. Another well-read, well-hit ball. A little bit outside. Still made solid contact. Just didn't have enough distance on it. Shoot. Top of the six. Bases loaded. Trev, do we even need to talk about what a Grand Slam is going to do for your stock here, bro? Like, come on. 0 for 2 on the day. Pretty sure we're on like a five-game hitting streak or something, so let's try to extend that here. Four-seam changeup, curve two-seam, same pitcher, Brian Sammons. Two outs. Tying run is 90 feet from the plate. Leading run is on second base. Here we go. Trying to hold the lead. Here's the delivery. Come on, baby! Let's go! Let's go! Woo! Dirk Dingers! The first 
ever Grand Slam. Our first ever Grand Slam, baby. That's what I'm talking about. What? Straight center field to a little bit left, I guess. But essentially straight, straight center. Deepest part of the ballpark, 394 feet right there. Projected about 407. We'll take it, dude. Gonna give us a three-run lead. Uh-huh. All right. Whew. That feels good, baby. How's that for an extra base hit, huh? Oh, shoot. All right. Just gonna be going to third here. Go ahead and get it there. Don't make any mistakes or anything. Probably didn't even have to throw it there. Could have just kind of held on to it. Throwing it to the cutoff guy. But, uh, it's all right. Top of the ninth. Holy cow. Shoot, I just skipped the replay. We should have basked in that moment one more time. We got AJ Cole in the mound with a slider forcing cutter change up at a curve. A no doubt homer. Now, that is one thing. I have seen your comments. and I, I've, I've got a, a plan here. All right, guys. I, I, I'm building a... a a, a story here. I'm, I'm, you know, kind of taking little increments here and there. I have seen comments of people saying like, why hasn't he messed with his swing animation or his pitching animation or his, you know, home run celebrations and stuff. We're going to get there. I, I've, I've got it all up here. I've got it all mapped out in my head. I don't want to get into... I didn't feel like it had enough on it. It's going to be shallow warning track there. Dang, dude. We had a bunch of really good hits here. Just couldn't find those gaps. Um... But yeah, just, I, I don't want to get into all that stuff right now because we've already got a, a, enough other exciting stuff happening. Once it gets deeper into the series and, and we're looking for more exciting things to try and just do differently, that's that's when we're going to mess with it. So just, just keep that in mind. I've already been looking at some of the cool celebrations and bat flips and stuff. It's, it's going to be cool. So look forward to that in the future, but uh, we'll take it, dude. That's what I'm talking about. McCutcheon's got a target on his back, and that just, that was a big step closer. Just blows my mind, bro. What, what was, he was, he's batting 180, and you've got somebody in your AAA affiliate that, that bat like 560 in, in spring training, and you aren't even going to give him a chance? He doesn't make any mistakes out in the outfield, at least I don't think we have yet. He absolutely smashes the seams off the ball. Behind the plate here. Four seam curveball slider change up with a two seam couple of guys on. Here we go. That's inside. Gonna wait on that. Just be smart about it. Early lead in the count. Here we go. See if we can have like a little three run shot situation. Uh, I tried to check it. Dude, that is a nasty curveball. That thing moved a ton. Holy cow. And be feeling good about yourself. Yeah, Diego, Let's go. I think one of the things you want to do, you get to the third game. You'd like to win this series and finish. It there off. it is. Find the gap. That should be able to get us at least an RBI. Well thrown ball, just not not even close. We'll take it. I mean, that, that's what you get with us. You get consistency. You, you can be fairly confident when we come up to the plate twice, we're going to hit at least once. And oftentimes, it's going to have a lot more behind it than you would you would get out of most guys. So it's just like, oh, shoot. Nope. I thought we were going double play there. My bad. I thought he was running. I was just going to keep on going to third, but I guess we'll just keep it put here. But yeah. I mean, so you're going to get people, you know, balls jump in the fence. You're going to get extra base hits. You're going to get lots of RBIs. Ooh, we got a bases loaded situation here. This is exciting. Hopefully it's not a double play. It found, found the gap. Let's go. I'm going. I'm going. I'm going. I'm aggressive. That was so stupid, Trev. That was... <laughs> Well, you're going to get terrible base running decision making. I, sometimes I just try to try to have fun with it. But, uh, yeah, man, I, I don't know. It, it doesn't make sense to me. Ooh, that's a home run. I don't even see it anywhere. Landed somewhere off to our left. I don't know. All right. So this is going to be a, a good ball game here, huh? 3-2. I'm going to advance a runner while even or ahead in the count. Uh, I'm gonna say let's let's advance a runner work on our clutch a little bit here. I just need to get a base hit Forcing curve slider change up at a two seam That's low inside the zone, but we'll take it. Thank you um Appreciate you this guy at the plate should assume nothing but heaters coming right at him 
Outside. 2-0 count. Way ahead. Pretty big trouble as a pitcher. That's right, baby. That's gone. That's got to... Oh, no. It's ground rule double. Oh, no. That... Oh, interesting. Interesting fence situation. I thought the, the top part of the fence was back behind it, and I thought it was going to, like, drop down into nothingness. We'll take it, though. That's a double. RBI double. That's going to help towards our, our progression chart. Shoot, dude. I thought that was going to be a home run, too. I was going to get excited. Cyrus Telshaw's up to bat. Got a 3-1 count. He's going to get walked. All right. We got two guys on and two guys out for Ryan Howard. One for one in the day so far. He's got a 2-2 count here. I'm taking off. Let's go. I mean, every every base we steal, that's adding to our, uh, you know, overall a bit. But um, just got to focus on hitting, like I said. Here we go. Dude, I feel like this is a long ball game. There's a lot happening in a little amount of time. We're still here in the bottom of the third. Looks like we might be able to make a play on this one. Woo! Middle warning track. That got a little bit scary, but we're going to be able to put them away. And uh, here we go. Coming up to bat. Top of the fourth. Two for two so far on the day. Four seam curve. Slider change up at a two seam. That's outside. And that misses for ball one. Like Dirk Dingers is a top 50 prospect, it says over on the right. It'd be nice if somebody gave him a freaking chance. <sighs> Out in front of the curveball, that was that was not good. He got us with that. He got us with that. Now the pitch. Oh, he got us with that one too. Come on, Trev. Let's go, bud. Let's go. One two count. Act like you've been here. Just swinging at junkers there. It's fine. We're two for three in the day. It's Don't worry about it, Trav. That was just kind of a bit of an off one there. All right, we've got a couple of guys on. Let's see if we can hit them home. Top of the sixth here. Four seam change up slider and a curve coming from Tommy Malone. Get through. Yes. Is it? I mean, that's an error, right? That's not going to count as a base hit. That's going to be... That's going to... Oh, no. Scores decisions a base hit. Okay. I guess it was kind of a tough play, but... Uh, definitely would have liked to, to get a little bit more than that, but it's it's fine. Cyrus Telshaw, two for two on the day. Oh, this is going to be big. Come on. Back-to-back -back grand slams, maybe? Back-to-back -back games? The most exciting team in AAA baseball. Nope. Not going to happen, but they are going to... At least be able to get that one guy home. Add another run to the board. Appreciate that. Nice job, fellas. And uh, here we go. Ryan Howard. Certainly wish it was Matt Verling, man. I did look. I, I was looking when I was looking at the the Phillies depth chart and looking at the roster and stuff. I looked for Matt Verling by the chance that he had gotten called up. It it's not the case. Oh, beautiful work. Is he gonna go home? I probably could have went to third there. They got him. They didn't get him? It's not easy to make that throw and give that catcher time to adjust his feet and get that tag down. No, a very aggressive send right there. You take a chance, you hope the throw is a little bit offline, and that paid off right there. I can't believe they didn't get him right there. That that surprises me. But, uh, yeah, I was hoping he had been called up to the Phillies and we might be able to reunite with him at some point in the future. Unfortunately, that is not the case, and uh, I think he was just traded either to another triple-A team or maybe even drop down to double-A. I don't think it's the way you can search for people and, and find out exactly where they went. So, Kind of sad about that, but uh, it's a way of life. Here we go. Bottom of the six. Going to be playing some defense here. Let's get it. Quick reaction time. Good fielding. We'll take it. Just out here making plays all day. Got Hunter Cole up to bat. Going to be doing the same thing here. Got a guy in first. Got to watch out for him in case something gets down on us. Nope. Quick reactions. Beautiful work. I'm going to just throw it to first just for fun. See if there's some way we could have potentially beat him back. But I guess that's not... It works on our arm accuracy. Might as well take an extra rip at it if we can. Got a four-run lead. Guy on second base looking to come home. Four-seam slider and a two-seam. 
first pitch of the AB. Oh play. my goodness. Bit too much. Right bit too much underneath it though. Dias is Shit. there and he has it for the okay. first out. And the runner not tagging well. will retreat to second. Hey, this was a pretty Could have done better those last two at-bats, but it's still a 500 average and uh, still got ourselves a win. That's what we love to see. Let's move on to our next game. Oh, no, man. Things are looking pretty good. Things are looking up. Let's see if we can go three for three with a uh, solid uh, solid campaign for our call-up today. Hopefully, I mean, you know, if we, if we can string together... 10 episodes of this, then, then we should get caught up. Actually, I, I think I think I'm probably gonna go on a pretty hard grind of uh, of off screen coming up here soon. Maybe even after this episode. I just kinda wanna I would love to see some more some more movement. That's gonna find the middle of the gap, but does it have too much hang time? Nope, it's gonna bounce off the wall. There it is, dude. Extra base hit all day. That's what I'm talking about. That's all we need right there. Lead off, double, getting on base. We're in scoring position. We're probably going to end up crossing the plate here as long as our teammates can get it together. And, and dude, just solid consistency. That's what you could expect out of us. Mr. Phillies. Whoever owns owns the Phillies. Whoever's in charge of these decisions. Your boy deserves a, a chance. For sure. Got a couple of strikeouts. Oh, look at these jokers out here, dude. Come on. We're going to strike out three times in a row. Taking off. Let me get those stealing points just for the heck of it. We're going to strike out three times in a row. Come on. Do you really think I belong down here playing with these guys? On some days, yes. There's no doubt about that. So. It's going to take time, dude. Can't, can't rush perfection. Ooh, look at that. Good reaction time. Go ahead and catch that ball. Number 15 nice is there, makes the catch, and the side is retired. So All they right. go quietly here in this half. Here we go, second at bat. At least we got a guy on this Next time. Another double would end up getting him home. Four seam slider change up and a curve. He reached base with a double his first time up. Yeah, oh, my goodness, that's not. That uh, it's not. Oh, it did. I'm going. I'm taking the double. I'm taking the double all day, baby. I can't believe that stayed fair. Okay. Back to back doubles. All right, let's hope our teammates can actually take advantage of this this time. Looks like Cyrus might get something popping. He's got an 0-1 count. I'm just going to take it easy. I'm not going to get anything too crazy. It's going to go to right. We're both going to take off. I'm going to get to third, and that's going to score a run. There it is. All right, we'll take it. Not bad. Not bad at all. See if we can maybe get a, a second one home as well. Omar, what you got? Batting 222 overall. Hey, I mean, even that's better than McCutcheon. Like, come on. If he's 35 years, what is it, 35? I think McCutcheon's 35 years old. He's cold. He's batting 180. Like, let, let the dude go. Just let it happen. All right. Well, we tried. Here we go. Coming up to bat again. We got two doubles on the day so far. Can we make it a third? Four seam slider change up, but a curve from Nate Pearson here. Lead run is on second. I don't know why that added to our batting clutch right there, because that wasn't clutch at all, but I guess we can't always be the hero. Bottom of the eighth, got a couple of guys on. We are going to power swing to advance a runner. Okay. I'm going to go ahead and guess a uh, four seam just to be safe here. We've also got a slider and a two seam coming our way. Looks like Brian's already a little bit tired, so that could right, the first that could play to our advantage. We're going to start off with a 1-0 uh, count here. Here we go. I'm tempted not even to power swing. Yeah, I didn't even power swing. Shoot. The power swings, it just, I, I feel like our normal swings always do so much better than power swings. I don't even care about the challenge. I would rather get the clutch hit and, and work on our, our stuff that way. So. Top of the ninth here. Looks like we are going to be going to extra innings. Oh, this is big. This is a big play right there, Trev. Let's go. Woo! All right. Let's see what happens. Bottom of the 11th. We got a guy on third base with two outs. Dude, we hit a grand slam. We've had numerous doubles. We have been the absolute hero of the day so far. Hero of the week. Can we continue it? Four seam change up, slider, and a curveball. 
I'm gonna guess just in case. Here's the first pitch. Popped him up. <sighs> Shoot. Geraldo is there to make the catch. Shoot! That's all right, man. Not every single thing can go perfectly the way we want it to go, but overall, fantastic job here. Like I said, I, I think I'm gonna do a little bit of grinding off screen. Probably play a few weeks, and uh, we'll just kind of kind of see see where we end up. So two for five on the day could have been better. Hope you guys enjoyed. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'm gonna see you guys in our next episode, and uh, peace out.